don't be too quick to rush out when you're feeling praying. And don't be more interested in what you are saying to God than what God has to say to you. So many times, stop going to pray, leaving your Bible behind. 1,000 words from you to God is not as powerful as one word from God to you. So one of the reasons why we pray is so that God can speak to us. Sometimes a scripture and at times gentle whisper of the voice of God in your heart. The word of God is a prophetic word. But you see, it is coded. It comes alive when the Holy Spirit breathes on it and talks to you from it. Otherwise, the letter kills it. The word of God, if you don't sit on it in meditation, in prayer, will be like ordinary word. When you begin to pray and you begin to look at scripture as you pray, there is nothing you cannot change. All the scriptures you think you know, if you are reflecting over them and you are praying, the Holy Spirit will show you something from it that you have never known. It will require an action based on that word. The book of Lord shall not depart of your mouth. Thou shalt meditate, that thou mayest observe to do. As you meditate, you will observe. There is something inside that word when you observe to do. So in other words, every scripture carries an instruction. At the level of reading, it looks like you have just studied the Bible. But if you are praying and you are looking at that scripture, after a while, life comes out of that scripture from the scripture and instruction comes. Once it gets to level of instruction, something supernatural will happen. We begin by praying and we are opening the scripture. It might not happen day one. After when you start discovering that your life is coded in that scripture, the Holy Spirit will start talking to you. Then you will see an instruction thou shalt observe to do when you do a miracle are inevitable. Now, what are you facing exactly now? Maybe I should give you an assignment. Can you go and look for scriptures that cover what you are going through right now? What the Bible says about that situation, and start with that. Don't begin to decree. First of all, start by meditating. When the Lord puts light in your heart, speak out that light.